let's get you the big story at this hour. It's coming in from the Supreme Court. A delegation from the Gujarat High Court Advocates Association has met with the Chief Justice of India, Chandra Chud, this afternoon over the proposed transfer of Justice Nikhil Karyal of the Gujarat High Court to the Patna High Court. Uh, uh, Chief Justice Chandra Chud, Justice Call, and Justice M.R. Shah were present in this meeting and we're told that the Chief Justices have taken note of the views of the delegation. Uh, what has been the outcome of the meeting? We will go across to Arvind uh, Gunasekar in a bit for more on this. But remember the background to this. Uh, this comes in the backdrop of just this week taking exception to the Gujarat High Court lawyers protesting over this proposed transfer of the Justice Nikhil Karel to the Patna High Court. The Union Law Minister Kiran Rijuju stepped into this matter. He uh, said, uh, basically questioned how every decision of the Collegium supported by the government should not and cannot be questioned. Listen in. There are issues. Yesterday I heard that some lawyers, they want to meet Chief Justice of India for a transfer case. Now, the issue may be, in, if you look from isolation, it may be one of the issues. But if this becomes a recurring instances for every decision taken by the Collegium or which is being support by, supported by the government, then where will it lead to? Then the whole dimension will change. Everywhere, it's not about judiciary alone. The, the changes are so fast in today's world that it's very difficult to, to catch up with the changes. So it's a, it's a kind of a rush with the time. Where will this lead? Well, let's ask Arvind Gunasekar, who's been monitoring uh, this meeting, a long-awaited meeting, Arvind, the G... Uh, the GHCA has been staging protests. They even decided, I think, to abstain from appearing before court. Finally, they've been able to put their grievances uh, before the uh, Chief Justice. Uh, what are you hearing? Uh, how did that go? What is the likely outcome? Has the Chief Justice, the Collegium's decision, uh, has that been finalized at all? Sarah, the delegation from the Gujarat uh, High Court Advocate Association met with the Chief Justice of India along with two other uh, senior judges here uh, in the Supreme Court. So this uh, meet is over the proposed uh, transfer of uh, Justice Nikhil Karyal uh, from uh, Gujarat High Court to Patna High Court. So the uh, Gujarat High Court Advocate Association is protesting over this very uh, proposed transfer of Justice uh, Nikhil Karyal from uh, Gujarat High Court to Patna High Court. In connection with this uh, protest, uh, today a delegation met uh, the Chief Justice of India, Chandra Chud, and also Justice uh, uh, Sanjay Kishan Kola and also Justice Emma Shah over this very issue. Justice Emma Shah is from Gujarat and that's why he was also part of this meeting. So this meeting went on for almost 30 minutes wherein the delegation uh, made their grievances and also they uh, they gave, they submitted their uh, representation to the uh, Supreme Court Collegium comprising of uh, two senior judges along with Chief Justice. Uh, Supreme Court, according to our sources, the judges, they took note of the grievances of this uh, delegation and then they have said that they will consider it and that's the only uh, 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 only answer that the Supreme Court judges have given to the Gujarat uh, uh, High Court Advocate delegation. So what we are being told is that though the uh, Supreme, in the meeting the Supreme Court judges also uh, asked the, uh, requested the High Court Association to, uh, High Court Advocate Association to withdraw the strike because the strike is uh, still on there over this proposed transfer and they have told them that we will consider your uh, grievances but in the meantime you should uh, withdraw the strike. That was the request from the uh, 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 Supreme Court uh, judges said. So what we are being told is that the High Court Advocate Association has convened the uh, general body meeting of the Advocate Association tomorrow and then this particular request of the Supreme Court will be decided, will be discussed in uh, tomorrow's meeting and then only the Advocate Association will take a call whether to continue with the strike or whether to withdraw the strike. But on uh, other hand side, though this particular meeting, the uh, collegiate meeting that took place on Wednesday, last Wednesday that was on November 16, wherein this particular proposal was discussed, the Supreme Court Collegium has not made this statement public. That means that this proposed transfer is still a proposal. It has not been officially signed by the Supreme Court Collegium. Only after the statement is put out, then this particular recommendation will be sent to the centre. In All the right. meantime, the High Court Advocate Association met with the Supreme Court judges today.